uh, my assessment is, uh, you know, in order to save the Labour Party, uh, as some people put it, you would need 100,000 people to join it that were either of a soft left or centre left persuasion. And I just don't believe in 2019 that is possible. Mm. Uh, and, and it would happen. I think the, the Labour Party, as we know, it is finished. The anti-Semitism over which he left. Uh, Bernard, in his introduction, mentioned that I have some, clearly I have some views on that. I've, I've been on the record and have said that um, I've drawn the analogy and I want to have your reaction to this statement. I've said I believe that anti-Semitism is the one ring of racism to lift from Tolkien's Lord of the Rings. It's the one ring of racism in the sense that it's the one form of racism. All racism is equally bad, but it's the one type of racism that has this dangerous capacity to unite the far left, the far right, and the Islamist theocrats. Do you agree with that? I mean, yes, I mean, I, I would agree that there's certainly there's there's very there's very strong similarities uh, between the anti-Semitism that we see in, in from those three uh, different areas, mm -hmm. uh, and we see people unite in different ways. Um, I, I would also attest that we see a hierarchy of racism, and um, there shouldn't be a hierarchy mm -hmm. of racism. You know, I joined a party in a movement that was about equality for all. But in terms of how anti-Semitism is contended with, it's you know, there's far too many people that are prepared to turn that blind eye. Uh, and or people that are prepared to push it to one side. Um, and if we're serious as a country with contending with racism in all its forms, then we can't treat one form of racism differently. And certainly other people have referred to it as the, the canary in the mine. You know, when I've uh, been knocking on doors and speaking to people over recent weeks, and it's come, come through very strongly before, but you know, it's been uh, just in the last few weeks very pronounced that it's people, it's the neighbours of the Jewish community and it's people from other ethnic minority backgrounds that are very, very aggrieved about the situation because if you can't contend with racism, one kind of racism within your ranks, what does it mean for another form of racism at a, a later moment?